Today and tomorrow, shorts weather. We'll just go out and say it. But I would maybe have something uh, that you can put on early today, you know, 40s, 50s, a little chilly if you're spending time outside. But, I mean, it doesn't get better than this for the afternoon. Mid-70s, sunshine, light south breeze. Looks really good into the afternoon and evening. It stays warm into tomorrow as well, but the wind starts to pick up out of the south. It could get gusty over 35, 40 miles per hour at times, and that is coming ahead of a cold front Wednesday night. Rain and a couple of weak thunderstorms will be possible. Behind the front, it turns cooler for the rest of the week. High temperatures drop back to the 50s, which is where they should be for this time of year. In the meantime, though, a big area of high pressure still in control of the weather from Maine all the way to the Ohio Valley. All this junk here in the upper Midwest will become our cold front as we move along. See the first signs of the organization occurring there right by North Dakota. All that to say it's still a ways out. We still have plenty of dry weather to enjoy before it actually gets here, at least another 36 hours or so. So out the door this morning, many of us in the 40s and lower 50s in the Champlain Valley, that is the case. It's not quite as warm as it was this time yesterday, but still warmer than normal for early in the morning this time of year. Sunny with a light south breeze in the afternoon. Gorgeous day. Get out and enjoy it if you can. It's mostly clear tonight. There will be a few areas of valley fog east of the Green Mountains into New Hampshire. But what you'll really notice through the day Wednesday is the wind picking up out of the south. Now, I think it stays bright for most of the day. We'll be watching the clouds come in from the west. They certainly get here first in northern New York, but the upper valley from Brattleboro to Lebanon should stay sunny start to finish tomorrow. Clouds likely move in right around lunchtime or so in the north country. And then here comes the rain after sunset, 10, 11 o'clock. A couple of downpours in northern New York crossing into Vermont and fading away by early Thursday morning. We're left with plenty of clouds and the wind turns out of the north, keeping our temperatures in the 50s for Thursday, Friday, into the weekend as well. Not a whole lot of rain with this front, uh, especially not in southern areas, but to the north, there could be a quick tenth of an inch or two, especially in the north country where the rain comes in first. But the biggest change you'll notice is in the temperatures. You'll see 77 to 51, 56 Friday and Saturday, and then cooler again on Sunday. Aside from a few more showers on Saturday, most of this forecast does look dry. Back to you. All right, then. Thanks.